Hello dear students, welcome back to my channel. It's been a long time since I've posted the videos, but since only four months left for HLC exam 2023, that is only around 100 plus odd days, I'll be doing a video series for maths and science, that is target 75 for maths and science. Dear students, last year the channel had received overwhelming response uh, from the student reached many parts of the state and helped many students to score good marks i believe i'll help the student to score good marks this year also for that i'll be creating this uh, target 75 plus video series in this video we will discuss the road map to score 75 plus for maths and science and also question paper pattern dear students it is very important to have a plan for four months and also you should know the question paper pattern without knowing the question paper pattern and the plan it is uh, very difficult to score good marks dear students if you are feeling difficulty in maths and science do take the doubt from your mind because the video series will definitely will help you with constant effort and hard work definitely in this four months you can score good marks what is the roadmap or plan to score 75 dear students last year i had created worksheet chapter wise but this year as there is a slight change in the exam pattern i'll be creating concept wise worksheet and video i'm repeating i'm creating concept wise worksheet for example if i take any unit any chapter in maths or science i'll split the chapter into concepts now i will create the videos concept wise and worksheet for example if i take arithmetic progression based on nth term or based on introduction to arithmetic progression this is one concept nth term is a concept one concept then sum of n terms so based on the concept i will create the worksheet and the videos mcqs one mark two mark three mark and four mark questions i'll be creating based on concept wise this will help you to solve any question concept wise if you are clear you will be able to solve any questions in the exams in the same way for science dear students per week i'll be creating four to five videos and worksheet and also after the end of this uh, concept wise video series i'll be doing uh, preparatory papers for practice and also revision classes Dear students, for this, do subscribe the channel. Don't miss out any videos. And also importantly for the worksheet, do join my telegram group. I'll post both these links in the description of this video. Dear students, do subscribe the channel and also join the telegram group for all the updates. Do join the telegram group and also if you are on instagram do follow my instagram page dear students will see maths question paper pattern we have seven themes number system algebra trigonometry coordinate geometry probability geometry and mensuration that is surface area and volumes in number system we have unit uh, real numbers so the total marks allocated is four marks whereas in algebra we have four units a pair of linear equation 
in two variables arithmetic progression polynomials and quadratic equation from these four chapters you will get 26 marks in the same way trigonometry as a units introduction to trigonometry and applications of trigonometry you will get nine marks from these two units in the same way coordinate geometry contains the unit coordinate geometry you can score five marks from this unit statistics and probability the theme statistics and probability you have two units statistics and probability the total marks allocated is nine for geometry we have triangles circles and construction that is 17 marks for these three units surface areas and volumes we have uh, two units areas related to circle and surface areas and volume from these two units you can score 10 marks total 80 marks these are the seven themes based on seven themes the question paper will be set dear students SLC exam 22-23 will be similar to the pattern of 2019-20 SLC exam already we have discussed dear students uh, based on remembering we have uh, 8 marks for understanding we have 44 marks application and analysis is 16 marks last year it was only 5 percent this year we, it is uh, 20 percent so for it is 16 marks and skill based on the skill it is 12 marks so there's a slight increase in the application questions this year dear students we have uh, 8 MCQs, 8 1 mark questions, 2 marks 8 question, 3 marks 9 question, 4 mark 4 questions and 5 mark 1 question, total 38 question for 80 marks. Easy level will be 30% 24 marks, average 40 marks, difficulty last year it was 10%, this year it is 16%. There is a slight change in the difficulty level and application based questions. So uh, that's why I am creating the concept wise video series and the worksheet definitely it will help you to score good marks if you put the continuous effort. Dear students still we have 4 months of time. If you can put all the hard work for 4 months definitely you can achieve the marks you are aiming for. So for choice questions in two marks, we have two choice questions in two mark questions, four choice questions in three marks and one choice question in four marks. It will be based on theme or within the same unit. Students mainly what you should understand is 38 questions for 80 marks based on seven themes. If you understand this, uh, whereas the concept wise, if I'm creating the videos that will help you to understand the more about the question paper pattern. Now for science, dear students for science it is uh, again it is uh, 38 questions, 38 questions for 80 marks. For science it is 38 questions for 80 marks again the question paper will have three parts part a physics part b chemistry and part c biology part a physics contains 28 marks part a physics is for 28 marks part b physics is so part b chemistry is 25 marks part c biology it is 27 marks Part A Physics 28 marks, Part B Chemistry 25 marks and Part C Biology 27 marks. Therefore, the question paper consists of three parts, Part A Physics, Part B Chemistry and Part C Biology. Part A Physics 28 marks, Part B Chemistry 25 marks, Part C Biology 27 marks. We have uh, in science, we have seven themes materials in daily life which contains the unit chemical equations acid bases and salts metal and non-metals carbon and compounds periodic classification of element for 25 marks 
Next uh, theme is world of living. It contains a unit life process, control and coordination, how do organisms reproduce, heredity and evolution for 22 marks. Natural phenomena, it contains two units, light reflection and refraction, human eye and the colorful world for 12 marks. How do things work? The theme is how do things work? That is the unit, you, uh, electricity and magnetic effects of electric current contains uh, for 13 marks. Next, the theme 5 is natural resources. We have three units, sources of energy, our environment and management of natural resources for 8 marks. Total, 38 questions for 80 marks. Again, remembering uh, 16 marks, understanding. Remembering 16 marks, understanding 32 marks, that is application questions, that is understanding the concept and applying your knowledge, 16 marks and skill, that is diagram, uh, that is uh, total is 16 marks, diagram will be uh, 12 marks and diagram based question, they will be give the diagram uh, and question will be given, you, you will be answering that, that is higher order thinking uh, skills that is for 4 marks total 80 marks again the pattern is same as maths 8 is MCQs 8 1 mark question 2 mark 8 question 3 mark 9 question 4 mark 4 question 5 marks 1 question total 38 question for 80 marks again the easy level for 24 average is 40 marks difficult for 16 marks Dear students, you should understand that there is a slight increase in the difficulty level and application based question when compared to last year that is 21-22 but that will not affect anything because if you are clear with the concept definitely you can score good marks. Dear students, I suggest you to subscribe the channel and also without forgetting do join the telegram group definitely that is going to help you over the time dear students uh, i'll be start i'll be starting posting videos and worksheet from this week only so take a printout of the worksheet do try to solve the questions and the, for science I'll be doing concept wise uh, the questions do try to finish on the same day don't delay it uh, at least we'll try to uh, finish the concept wise video series within January otherwise Feb February first week before the preparatory exam by the SLC board dear students start afresh whatever the things has happened leave it aside you have four months for the exam if you concentrate and put effort for this four months definitely you can score good marks definitely this video series will help without any hesitation do watch the complete video series and since there is a slight increase in the application based question i'll be posting more application based question that will definitely help to clear your concept and also what are the worksheet if you are able to solve all the questions definitely in the exam you will be able to score all the questions what I am trying to aim is to make you to clear the concept to clear the concept dear students do subscribe the channel and join the telegram group if you want to support the channel, you can uh, join the channel. Dear students, thank you for watching the video. I will be posting the video series as soon as possible. Thank you.